Hey, you're welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be talking about the business ecosystem here in Aquaibom State. If you're looking out to move down here to Aquaibom State and you're thinking about setting up a business, starting up a business, what type of business you should kick start, then this video is for you. Uh, for the past few months, most people, uh, a lot of people have called me to ask for suggestion on what type of business they should start up here in Aquaibo State and if it's going to be profitable because most people think Aquaibo State is a civil servant state but that's not true because businesses do run here it depends on the type of business you're looking out to set up and how you kick start it and also based on the location you're also looking out for this business and what you should know about this video i'm not a financial advisor or a business expert every single idea and a Every single idea I'll tell you in this video is based on my own experiences and my own perspective. Like I said, a lot of businesses you would probably kickstart is either a business with low capital or a business with uh, a huge capital. So in this video, I'll, I will really focus on businesses with uh, limited capital, with small capital first. So let's say you you're relocating to acquire boom at first and you don't have much capital so one of the easiest business to kick start is uh food and restaurant so let like food and restaurant it's kind of very easy but because uh, we eat a lot quite when people love good food and we eat a lot if you're kicking up a food or restaurant business it's easy for you because you can actually register with any dispatch rider to you know to dispatch your food to your customers reaching them through social media and every other thing like that so basically you don't really need uh, an outdoor you know a spot to run this type of business but if you have money to run the business even with an outdoor spot you can also do this very well and it will really work for you because we eat here in Aquaibum and if you're cooking here in Aquaibum your food uh, kind of you can actually make a very good meal and people will still eat okay so the next type of business you can probably kick start here in Aquaibum it's a business I would probably call a fresh mat fresh mat business uh, not just fresh mat kind of business that you probably go to some local places to buy food stuff and uh, you know we bill it to people in other states like I said we have uh, two places here in Aquaibum state that really do a uh, kind of uh, produce a whole lot of crayfish uh, fish and other things which is all run which I made a video about the last time I I said about places to visit here in Aquaibum state so we have all run and Ibno where you can probably buy crayfish and we bill it to people in other state so you see Aquaibum state it has this business ecosystem that people don't really know so that's like few businesses you could probably kick start with low capital so the next business uh, if you have a huge capital and you want to invest is a real estate so if you really have huge capital and you want to invest in real estate I'll probably advise you do because we're actually running out of housing shortage. A lot of people are planning to move to Aquaibo State, but we don't really have much houses. So it must not really be a kind of a big or any. Even if, even if you're building South Con, South Con apartments throughout, you probably get people uh, patronize you. Okay, the next business I'll also advise you to venture into if you have huge capital and you're planning to move down here to Aquaibom State is actually tourism and hospitality. Seriously, we have lots of uh, people coming here for tourism and also uh, a whole lot of people patronize hospitality business a lot ranging from hotels to lounge to you know to just places to places that you can probably you know enjoy your life or do jaye jaye so it really really do work here so uh, if you're moving out to acquire boom and you have a huge capital for a type of business like this i really advise you to come 
come to my state and invest just come down here and invest so you really get much profit back because the state promotes a kind of uh, it promotes businesses okay 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 so the next business are uh, would I really call it a business or should I say uh, building your career okay let's say let's say IT yeah IT so uh, Aquibum states it's a place I can probably run an IT agency like information technology agency because you can work from anywhere in the world and uh, you know you don't really have to pass through a whole lot of traffic jam or, or getting to a whole lot of things because things can really move here very well and you have that easy flow to take talent uh, because the tech community here in Aquibum is actually evolving very fast so uh, I know you okay so uh, with all these things I believe uh, there are more and more and more to these and I'll still mention some of these in the next video but before considering doing any business or starting any business at all like I used to say I'm not a financial advisor or a business expert you need to do your market survey very well before planning to kickstart any business Thank you for watching this video. Peace out for the next one.